Just like the grain pattern that's found within wood, the lens also has an internal grain that provides natural planes of cleavage. These planes act as potential fault lines that enable the lens to be split using a chopper in the same way that wood can be split using a wedge. To illustrate this principle of FACO chop, we'll use this old millstone as our FACO handpiece and its central axle as the needle. The log is going to be the nucleus which has been pre-drilled in the centre here so that it can be then effectively impaled by our FACO tip to hold it securely in place. The wedge is positioned in the edge of the nucleus opposite the FACO tip and then it's driven in along the grain to create an initial fault line. 